Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna apologize for the way my voice sounds. I'm getting over a head cold and I'm still a little congested. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, I did a video on a pair of men's white Gucci driving shoes. And um, I don't know about anybody else, but for me, I like to match the color of my shoes with the color of my belt, but I don't always match designers. Um, sometimes I'll wear shoes and a belt by the same designer. Sometimes I'll mix it up. Um, I never wear like a shirt, pants, shoes, belt, jacket, all by the same designer. It makes me feel like an ad, um, like an advertisement. I, I don't, I don't like that, but, um, like I'll wear Gucci shoes and a Louis Vuitton belt or Ferragamo shoes and a Gucci belt. And if you've watched any of my other videos, you know that I don't really like gold hardware. I don't like the color yellow or gold, um, in general and finding a white belt to match my shoes especially since the shoes have silver hardware, um, was challenging. Uh, the white Gucci belt has gold hardware, the white Louis Vuitton belt, and the Damier Bean gold hardware. Um, even the Versace white belt, gold hardware. And then I found this. Um, I store all my belts coiled, and these I do store in the dust bag, and if they come with a box, I keep them in the box, and I keep them on a shelf in my closet. Um, for, I ordered this online, and Versace didn't send me a box. I just got the dust bag. The dust bag itself is really nice. Actually, it's a really soft cottony on the outside and on the inside. Um, it's kind of hard to see, but it's kind of like this uh, woven material that really protects the belt really nicely. Um, in a very, very faint blue, it says Versace with the Medusa head. And yes, that's how you pronounce it. It's Versace, not Versace. Um, I heard someone say that not that long ago, I cringed. Anyway, um, this is the belt, and I'm gonna start with the hardware. Um, some designer belts, the end of the belt, when you put it through the buckle, goes behind, like Louis Vuitton and Hermes. Um, Gucci and uh, Versace, it doesn't. The, the end of the belt goes through lo a loop on the front of the belt, and this is the buckle. And you can see that it's in a very, very high polished silver. It's the Medusa head with the Greek key. That's what this design is so called. Some people will also call it Greco, but this is in fact technically called Greek key. Um, surrounding it, the belt is a good size. You can see based on the size of my hand, how big the buckle is. It's nice, but not too nice, uh, not too big rather. The entire belt has amazing, amazing detail, even this that holds the belt, the little loop, it's a smooth calfskin. The stitching is, is beautiful. And the whole belt is pressed with this diamond Greek key pattern. So it's the Greek keys, and then they're in a diamond formation, over, under, over, under. Um, it's really, really beautiful. Um, it's very, very subtle. If you're at a distance, you can barely see it. And this is only maybe, I don't know, eight inches, maybe 10 inches away. But it's really, really uh, beautiful. This is my first Versace belt, and I was just amazed at the quality, the stitching. The inside is this uh, almost suede, uh, actually it would probably be like a new buck uh, leather um, in this very, very light tan. I wear a size 100. Um, I don't know what the 40 means. I'm guessing it's 140. Uh, I have a 36 inch waist, so uh, I'm on the third hole in when I wear this. And it has the loop so that when the uh, belt loop itself slides, it won't slide all the way out. It stops at a certain point. And then I always usually push it a little forward because my jeans and my pants, the belt loop uh, on the jeans and pants usually come about here. Um, they all have serial numbers and then uh, the size. And I'm gonna flip this back around and show you the holes have these little lines and that's a design that some belt manufacturers use because it reduces the amount of stretch the hole will have from inserting and pulling out uh, the belt buckle, um, the post on the belt buckle. I wear it in the third hole and I've worn this belt a few times. You can see the hole is a little uh, oblong shaped at this point uh, because it does, you know, it is gonna pull a little, that's, that's natural and it's normal, um, but really, really nice. There's n not much in the way of glazing. Um, on the edge, it's white, and you can see it. 
there, but it's not a very thick belt. Um, I believe this is only uh, 36. Um, it would be 36 um, millimeters. Um, a lot of belts are 38 or 40. I usually prefer a 40 or a 38, especially with jeans, but again, I, I didn't have a whole lot of choice with the white. So this is my Gucci, I, I'm sorry, this is my Versace, my white Versace Medusa Greco belt to go with my white Gucci driving shoes. Um, please leave comments below and please keep them positive. Um, up to five subscribers, which I want to thank each of them. Um, and I hope to get more subscribers. And if you have any questions or any comments or anything that you'd like to see, um, please let me know. Thanks for watching and have a great day.